There are certain weapons in Terraria which can very easily be forgotten about due to the way it is obtained or its purpose. The Gladius is one of these weapons. The Gladius is a pre-hard mode short sword which is in fact one of the most powerful short swords in the game. Although that sounds great on paper, unfortunately the short sword class is possibly the worst collection of weapons in the whole game, apart from the copper short sword of course. The Gladius is one of the few drops featured in the marble biome, which is probably why it is so unheard of. If it wasn't for me loving the look of smooth marble blocks, I wouldn't have even known it existed. It has a 1 in 40 chance of dropping from hoplites. As this and Medusa are the only enemies which spawn in this biome, it's pretty easy to farm for late game. However, this is a pre hard mode weapon and therefore typically would be farmed for with much less powerful gear. Hoplites are extremely annoying to deal with early game and will put a lot of people off farming for this weapon in the first place. Of course, the question we're all asking is, how does it actually perform? Well, not great, but not terrible either. Considering you could technically obtain this weapon in the first few minutes of creating a new world, its base damage of 15 is pretty sweet. It is without a doubt an upgrade to the copper short sword you start with, but come on, a short sword is a short sword, you're going to struggle to take out pretty much any boss with this thing unless you can tank the damage. With that in mind, let's see how it does against the Eye of Cthulhu. It's worth noting that I'm fighting this thing with way higher tier armor than I should be. This is simply so we can test the weapon's potential, not my ability to dodge attacks. This fight was not easy, you have to basically jump into the eye to deal any real damage. You can get some great hits when it's stationary, but other than that, like other early melee weapons, you're going to struggle. Oh and yes, uh, this happened. Just wanted to point out that in my 8 years of playing this game, this is the first time I've had a fallen star KO a boss. Moving on, I also attempted to kill the King Slime with this weapon, but found this literally impossible due to its scuffed hitbox. Like I don't think you can actually deal damage with this sword without taking damage yourself. I also equipped an accessory which improved this weapon drastically, Feral Claws. The Gladius swings in bursts of free but does not have auto swing. Using a melee glove makes this a lot less painful to use. This didn't improve my range though, so this battle ended how you would expect. So now we need to ask ourselves, why is this weapon so forgotten? Apart from it dropping from a relatively difficult enemy in an obscure biome, I think it also has no purpose. The short sword class is a weapon range which is usually left in the first 30 seconds of playing. In summary, the Gladius is just not worth the grind for. If it fired a projectile or did tons of damage, maybe it would be worth considering. But in its current state, you're better off just using something else.